why former governor, lieutenant governor rather, Justin Fairfax is pushing back against damaging claims against him. In 2019, Fairfax became caught in a scandal accused of sexual assault years earlier. He denied all of those claims and now he's going further in an effort to clear his name. I looked into the new move he's making. Weeks after former Lieutenant Governor Justin Fairfax revealed the FBI is examining whether there's a political motivation behind sexual assault allegations against him, the former Lieutenant Governor is filing a defamation lawsuit against New York Public Radio. In it, he says the intentionally fabricated allegations by the two accusers were presented as fact with factual malice in a 2021 program. Fairfax has been pushing for an investigation into the alleged incidents for three years, believing such a probe would clear his name. Attorneys for both accusers have been unwavering in their defense of their clients' accounts. Fairfax spoke about the need for due process on the Roland Martin unfiltered daily digital show. If I could have filed a complaint on myself, I would have done it uh, because I would have at least initiated an investigation, uh, started due process, and this smear campaign would have unraveled three and a half years ago. Now, the attorney for one of Fairfax's accusers, Vanessa Tyson, who was interviewed on New York Public Radio, said today Dr. Tyson stands by her allegations. Fairfax is also thanking former Governor Doug Wilder for recently repeating that the allegations should be investigating. 